Hi everyone, welcome back to our math channel, Math Bridges Fun with Math. In this video, we will learn the concept of division as equal sharing. How the sharing can be done using some examples. Let's see. In this video, we are learning division by sharing. So what do you mean by that? When something is shared or distributed equally, it is known as division. In short, we can say division means sharing equally. This is the symbol for division. One horizontal line we have to write. A dot above and a dot below. Like how we are having for addition plus, for multiplication into and subtraction minus. In the same way, this is a symbol for division. A line and a dot above and below. It is known as obulus. And it was introduced by a Swiss mathematician John Rand in 1659. Let's consider one example. To show division as equal sharing, six apples are to be shared equally among two friends. Let's see. Six apples. And two friends are Rina and Sonu are two friends. Let's see how sharing of these apples can be taken place between these two friends. Here the first apple, it goes to Rina. Now the second apple, it goes to Sonu. The third apple will go to Rina again. Here we are sharing equally. So we are giving one one apple to each person. Sharing has been taken place. And the next to the fourth apple, it will go to Sonu. The next to fifth apple, it will go to Rina. The remaining one apple, it will go to Sonu. Here you can see Rina got three apples and Sonu got three apples. Means six apples when shared equally, each person got three apples and three apples this side. Means equal sharing has been taken place. It means when six apples are shared among two friends. Sharing means I'm using the division symbol over here. A sleeping line one dot above and one dot below. So each friend got three apples. This we will make it much more simpler using numbers and only the division symbol means mathematical symbols 6 divided by 2 equals to 3 instead of writing all this like the English language we are making it simpler as 6 divided by 2 is 3 it means the same when 6 apples are shared among 2 people each person got 3 apples this is the division fact now let us see one more example for division as equal sharing here the example is Share 10 bananas equally between 5 monkeys. Your 10 bananas. We are sharing these bananas among 5 monkeys. So now, the first banana to the first monkey. Next one to the second monkey. To the third monkey, the fourth banana to the fourth monkey, fifth banana to the fifth monkey. Now, sixth banana to the first monkey again, seventh banana to the second monkey, eighth banana to the third monkey. Ninth banana to the fourth monkey and the last tenth banana to the last fifth monkey. Now you can observe here how many bananas are they with each monkey. Yes, it is two. Each monkey got two bananas. That means ten bananas when divided among five monkeys. Each monkey got two bananas. Same this statement we will be representing using numbers and mathematical symbols. That means 10 divided by 5 equals to 2. This is the division fact for the equal sharing. That means 10 bananas when shared among 5 monkeys, each monkey got two bananas. Now let's see some examples how to solve the division by sharing method this is share the following means the items whatever pencils or coins or beads whatever it's been given equally among the given number of people 
and also write the division fact for each means the first question 12 pencils to be shared among six people here one box each box you consider it to be as one person so this 12 pencils we have to share it among six people now it takes a lot of time for us to draw pencils so we consider one pencil to be as one line in the box we will be drawing so start from the first box we are sharing first pencil to the first person second pencil third pencil fourth pencil fifth pencil sixth pencil it's done now again to the first person six pencils over so now again seventh pencil eighth pencil ninth tenth eleventh and twelve pencils so we have distributed all the 12 pencils to the six people so now each person is having how many pencils see in the box how many are they each person got two two pencils this is called equal sharing so how do we write the division fact for this it is 12 divided by 6 equals to 2 what does it mean 12 is the total number of pencils always remember the total should be the first number is divided means is shared among how many people six people that's why we are writing divided by six so each person got two pencils the answer what has been given in the box two two pencils that will be your answer now let's see one more example 15 rupees among five people means we have to share this 15 rupees share it equally among five people now coins also we will consider it to be as a small circle this each box 1 2 3 4 5 each box will consider to be as one person so let's start 15 rupees 1 rupee already we have given to the first person 2 rupees 3 rupees 4 rupees 5 rupees now again to the first person 6 rupees 7 rupees 8 rupees 9 rupees 10 rupees now 11 12 13 14 and 15 rupees done so we have distributed 15 rupees so how do we write the division fact 15 divided by 5 equals to 3 what does it mean 15 rupees total the total amount should be the first number is shared among 5 people means divided by 5 each person got 3 coins means 3 rupees slowly when you practice multiplication tables see 5 3 is a 15 it will be your answer divided by 6 directly you can write see 6 into how much is 12 you can see 6 2s are 12 see for 12 15 16 we can draw like this but if it is 100 120 98 88 can we draw like this it will not be possible so multiplication tables definitely help us to write the division fact you can practice much more problems of this kind thank you for watching the video like share and subscribe to our channel mad bridges fun with math and do share it with your friends thank you everyone